Hi guys! Welcome back to another vlog. On our third day in Thailand, we scheduled a full day for a club tour in the province of Ayutthaya. Our first stops will be the Bangpain Summer Palace and Central Ayutthaya. Hi guys! Good morning! Another day has passed and this is our third day in Thailand. We actually booked a group tour through Kluk for today's itinerary and we went with their Ayutthaya tour. We paid 5,460 pesos for two people to take this tour. We were instructed to meet at the pickup location in front of the Siam Center 15 minutes before 10 a.m. We actually took the train to get here and the cost of our tickets was only 56 baht. We decided to look for a place to eat breakfast because we arrived early and fortunately, we discovered a McDonald's that was already open. We placed our order and paid 268 baht for our first meal. Together with the other members of our group, we boarded the bus that was provided by Kluk. As soon as we boarded, water bottles and muffins for snacks were handed to us. We had Rose and M as our tour guides. M did a great job of giving us background information about Ayutthaya while we were traveling to our first destination. But my husband and I couldn't help but have a sleepy eyes from staying up late the night before. So even before we arrived at our first stop, we fell asleep. Roll down with the images, the all the ancient antique roll downs and other things presented in the huge area right in the middle of the island where this city used to be the capital city of the country. Uh, Ayutthaya Island. Ayutthaya Island. Surrounded by three main rivers. Chapaya River, same river down to Bangkok. And straight down to the sea in the west, Lopuri River in the north, and Pansam River in the east of Ayutthaya Island, together with the high brick city walls, 20 meters high and 5 meters thick, to protect the capital cities from 2 by 34 feet to stand tall and long life. 417 years before destroyed by the enemy after 15 times invader by the enemy, and then the was sacked. Destroyed our enemy was Myanmar, Burma, no? Myanmar, Myanmar, and now we are best friend. And, uh, one of the 10 ASEAN countries, AEC, no? AEC, now open border trade, trade, trade. Uh, but before we were enemy, no? Destroy. And you are destroyed because of death. 15 times. <laughs> no, but it's okay, it's okay. We learn to forgive. But hard to forget. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the Lord Buddha tell us. I have to learn to forget. I have to forget. Okay. As soon as we arrived at Bangpain Summer Palace, we were informed that we were not permitted to film inside the place. Only photographs were allowed. Additionally, we were informed that due to the vast area, we could avoid walking by renting a golf cart for 400 baht. The site was first used by the royal court as a summer retreat in the 17th century. However, the palace was destroyed by the fall of Kingdom of Ayutthaya and was restored by King Rama IV in the mid-19th century. Most of the buildings that exist today date from the reign of King Rama V who regularly spent his summers here. The structures represent a variety of architectural styles set in a large park around ponds and waterways. My food is delicate. I'm going to 
Kailangan sa ano mo? Sa kamay mo? <laughs> Ila yun 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 Ay, ang cute! Ang laki! Ang marami! Ang marami! Ang marami! Si Pong. Pong talaga pangalan. After feeding the turtle and the fishes, we just made the most of our time driving around in a golf cart. We will definitely remember this moment sometime in the future. Oh, one more, one more. One, two, three. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Central Ayutthaya is a department store and shopping plaza in Ayutthaya province. It can be considered as another big shopping mall of Ayutthaya. This is actually where we had our lunch. We received some 50 baht vouchers from Kluk. In Thailand, food courts are places where a number of food vendors come together to sell a variety of dishes. While every food court is different, most of them adhere to the same idea. A customer purchases a food coupon or voucher from the food court and uses it to buy food from any of the individual food court vendors. We spent 400 baht for lunch, but since we had a 50 baht coupon, we only paid 350 baht. We only had time to eat, after which we boarded the bus and prepared to travel to our next destination. That's it for this video guys. Thank you again for watching and see you again on the next vlog.